Intel 10th General Core Comet Lake SIGP Disabled Processor Lineup Detailed With its 9th generation core processor series, Intel adapted an interesting strategy to maximize its yields and increase competitiveness of its desktop processors. The F model number extension would go on to denote a lack of integrated graphics. It could be used in conjunction with other extensions such as K, Unlocked Base Clock Multiplier. Completely disabling integrated graphics would allow Intel to salvage dies on which the IGBU component, which takes up a large chunk of the die area, doesn't clear validation. Intel refers to this as GT0, Graphics Tier 0, to fit into its IGBU tier differentiation scheme. The company also tends to price its FSKUs slightly lower, letting it compete with AMD Ryzen chips better. A case in point is the Core i5-9400F often found under $160, and proving a strong alternative to the Ryzen 5 series for gaming PCs. With the 10th generation Comet Lake S family, the company is planning several new F and K FSKUs. According to a company slide leaked to the web by Infa or Maticacero, there are at least three each of F and K FSKUs in the works. The lineup includes a 10 core 20 thread i910900 k f and i910900 f, the 8 core 16 thread i710700 k f and i710700 f, and the 6 core 12 thread i510600 k f and i510600 f. Clock speeds and cache sizes of these chips are identical to their corresponding non FSKUs i710700 kf clock speeds being identical to those of the i710700 k provided they're sold at slightly lower prices the lack of an igbo doesn't affect target buyers of these chips pc gamers or creative professionals who use graphics cards and don't need an igbo competing risen processors lack igbos by design intel is expected to debut its 10th generation core comet lake s processors in april